beaches, delicious food, hiking, dinosaurs. More beaches. More beaches. This is Oahu. There's so much to do and see around Oahu, but here are some of our favorite things to do. Hi, I'm Jordan. And I'm Erica. And this is the Hawaii Vacation Guide. So there is so much to see and do on Oahu. We absolutely love it. We wanted to give you a quick little appetizer, a lay of the land so you could start planning your trip. So we lived on Oahu for a couple of years. Oh, just had the best time exploring it. And now that we live on Maui, we do make frequent trips back over there. So often that people are like, what are you doing back here? Yeah, do you live it's there? It's kind of weird. <laughs> <laughs> so consider this your Oahu appetizer, right? Head to our website for the full course. We have everything on Oahu and really go into the details and describing the stops and everything to do. Check out our itineraries. It is at thehawaiivacationguide.com slash Oahu. And you download that itinerary and boom, your vacation planning is all done. Geography. I love kind of understanding like the lay of the land and so you can get around more easily. So Oahu is two massive shield volcanoes that are heavily eroded and in the middle you have like the central valley of the island. You can't drive all the way around the island because Ka'ena Point, if I'm saying that right, uh, you just can't drive around that point. So we'll take you up through the central valley and then around the north shore and the windward side of the island so you see everything that Oahu has to offer. Also, where to stay on Oahu. So the main three areas are Waikiki, Koalina, and North Shore. Waikiki is the most popular area. It's amazing. Over half of all tourist dollars for Hawaii are spent in Waikiki. And that area is only three blocks deep by two miles long. And I don't blame it. That's where we like to stay when we go back because it's so centrally located. Sometimes. Sometimes. From there, you can spread out all over the place. But sometimes is we love staying up at the North Shore, like at a Turtle Bay Resort. And from there, too, you can see a lot of great things on the island. We have a whole video on where to stay that kind of breaks down these areas. So make sure you watch that video. All right. You ready? Let's do this. <laughs> All right. About to leave. Already packing. Come with me. I'm not really asking. Sweet. Thanks a lot. All right. Looking forward to it. Oh, yeah, they don't mind. Heading out, Queen's Break. walking to our Chinatown right now. Great history already. It's done by the Hawaiian Heritage Center. We got a link below. It's $35 per person. And I mean, it's like a full walking tour and also like a little food tour too. We stop at five different places. I think it's gonna be three today because of COVID. We've already learned so much stuff. And this little place is rich in culture. So many people have come here throughout the generations to Chinatown. We're gonna learn all about it today. Seafood market. Oh, this is Magura Brothers. This is what I wanted to check out. This is the back of the market. They're not joking. It's a hard one to find. The secret spot for the sushi bowls. 24 ounce smoothie for $5. You want to try it? <laughs> Two fingers up.
gonna keep it low now If you wanna go, let's go Let's wrap it up and hit the road I just got an awesome vibe Striking the wind of hopes now Liberty's on my mind We've taken off, we've left the ground You You gotta understand That we get one chance, one chance What is that thing? A dinosaur. That is, that is a big dinosaur. We got our first dinosaur sighting. Oh So one of our favorite things to do is rent kayaks and kayak out to the Mokes. We're not gonna do that today. Attention span of a two year old probably isn't gonna be great for that. So when you rent kayaks, it's over by the market and right by Kailua Beach. You leave by Kailua Beach, which is around the point, and then you just have to kayak all the way out, which isn't that bad. It looks really bad, but you get moving pretty fast. And then there's a beach over there and you can just bring some food and relax. And it's like you have your own little private beach.
at Makapu'u. Look out, and that's Makapu'u Beach right there. And that's where we're heading right now. Look at this. It's a beautiful Makapu'u Beach. You can see like great for bodyboarders down there. You get a nice view of the lighthouse. This is a cute little tucked in beach right here. So that was a lot. <laughs> big drive. <laughs> big, big trip around Oahu. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you are in your trip planning phase and you are like, oh my goodness, I want to see all of this. I need to figure out how to see the most of the island when I get there on my limited vacation days, head to the hawaiivacationguide.com slash Oahu. We have an itinerary there for you that breaks down our favorite spots, restaurants, activities, and then gives you excursion days. So you can get out and see everything and it's all planned for you. A lot more detail than what we shared here to make your trip planning a breeze. Thanks so much for watching. Thank you.